week ago, Jim, my friend at work, asked me this. My AutoCAD block is not showing in paper space. I told him to let me inspect his drawing and after open it, I found out that the object not showing in viewport was a annotative block. Wanna know how we fixed it? I started with the easiest solution and because of this I opened the layer palette to check the, the to check that the problem wasn't a simple frozen layer inside a viewport. After verifying the block layer and getting inside the viewport, Jim and I realized that the block layer wasn't the reason why the block wasn't showing in paper space. And because of this, I tried the second alternative, but before doing anything, I asked Jim whether he cares about keeping the block intact or not. Because if not, we could simply use the burst command to explode the block and fix the issue. Not explode command as this would remove the block attribute content. However, Jim wanted to keep the block intact, so I explained him that this was an annotated block. Well, what the hell is that? He replied. I briefly explained him that annotative objects are used as an automated way to control the size at which objects are showed or displayed in viewports. These can be text, blocks, hatches, and more. Finally, I explained Jim that since annotative objects are defined by specifying the annotation scales at which they should be displayed for in viewports. If a scale is not assigned but is used in a viewport, the object won't be displayed. I knew this could be causing Jim's block not to show in paper space. So after very find that the viewport scale one quarter of an inch equals a foot existed on the annotation object scales but still the block was not showing in viewport I reset the I restarted the viewport by changing the scale and going back to one quarter of an inch equal a foot and boom as magic Jim's blog showed up. My friend was happy and ready to leave, but before I let him go, I asked whether he wanted to keep the annotative properties of his blog or not. Please get rid of it, he said. So I proceeded to open the blog in Block Editor and change its annotative properties from yes to no. Ever since that day, Jim had no more problems with AutoCAD block not showing in paper space. Hey, this was Jim's idea, so thank him by liking this video.